Lucas assisted, uh, he had seven assists, six of them went to you. Um, and he's assisting on about a quarter of your makes so far this season. He's a point guard, obviously he's gonna find his scores, but is there something else there that, that allows you two to kind of work so well together? Um, you know, just, we've been playing together for a long time. I think me and Smart are probably the longest tenure Celtics. I think he's the, the first and I'm the second, right? So, you know, we just playing off one another. I think a lot of my, my assists went to him as well. So, you know, Smart's a guy, he, you know, he believes in me. He's one of the guy that's always letting me know, like, like you're one of the better guys in this league too. Don't let everybody forget that. So, you know, I appreciate him for, you know, being a great teammate, being a great supporter. Uh, me and Smart, we've had, you know, fights. We've been had ups and had downs, but at the end of the day, you know, that's my brother and I, I appreciate him, you know, trying to make me be the best version of myself. You've obviously played with a lot of great point guards here. You've had, you know, Kyrie and, and Kimba, and, but those guys are all more score first. Marcus is probably the first real pass first point guard you've played with. What, what does that do for you, your game, and what does that encourage you to do? Um, all of the above, you know, Smart is, is looking to get everybody, you know, going. And I think that he's gotten his opportunity to be, you know, a starting point guard in this league. And, and he helped us go to the finals last year. You know, um, in this league, you know, what's sensationalized is scoring the ball. You know, but there's so many aspects of basketball, like people who are purists of the game of basketball that just go that people, you know, don't even pay attention to. And, and Smart does a great job of setting the tone energy-wise on defense, his pickup points each and every night, his talking, you know, his hustle plays. You know, he might not get, you know, praise because he didn't score 25 points a game, but he affected the game, and he helped us win. He brought the energy. He got hustle plays. Um, so, you know, in this society, he might not get the credit that he deserves, but, you know, Smart is a big reason why we're having our success um, this year. And last year we went to the finals. You know, he's the, the, the head of the snake. He's the, our defensive leader. You know, he's our energy guy, young game changer. He's, he's diving on the floor for loose balls, all of the above. And that allows me, guys like me, Jason, and to be able to do what we do. But I appreciate Smart because he does a lot of the dirty work night in and night out. Jalen, what was it like tonight to be the number one option? I mean, going back to the starting lineups and hearing your name last, I mean, what's that like to be the guy for, not, I mean, you're all one of the guys on this team, but just for one night without Jason? It was fun, you know, just coming out, playing basketball with our teammates. That's about what the season is about. You know, it's going to be guys in, guys out. Um, so being able to maintain, you know, our level of play, you know, but one of our, you know, our leader, our big dog, not being in a in a in a rotation, it was, it was fun. It comes out, it challenges everybody, it allows everybody to step up in their role. Um, but we all we all have capabilities. We all are talented. I got full faith and belief in myself in any situation. But you know, that's a part of being on a winning team. You know, being able to be a team player, making the right plays, making sacrifices in order to get back to where we want to do. Like I have no problem with that at all. Um, so I come out each and every night and I do my job, and um, I'll continue to do that. But I know I'm capable of doing more. Jalen, um, three in a row for you guys, 12 of 13 overall. You guys have, you know, 16 and four, a uh, quarter of the way through the year without Rob. Where, you, where, you, where do you evaluate in terms of where you guys are at as a team right now? Are you, is this even surpassing where you guys you thought you might be right now? I know you guys are thinking about big picture, but just to be rolling like this at this point? I think we're in a good spot. Um, and I think that we still haven't played our best ball yet. You know, defensively, you know, I think we could pick it up. You know, I think we've been a little bit, you know, you know, we let our offense kind of dictate things. Um, and we can be better in spots. And that starts with, you know, our veteran guys. It starts with me and it starts with us. And as the year goes on, we that's something we're going to emphasize for sure. Um, but I like the spot that we're in. We're playing great basketball. You know, we empowering our guys, you know, to come in and be aggressive. Um, they feel comfortable in their roles. Um, we shooting the shit out of the ball, and um, we playing the game the right way. So not too much to ask when you when you look like that. So look like Celtic basketball to me. 
Uh, Marcus was just telling a story in here about how when you were, I think, a rookie, you had this idea that you wanted to, when they were telling you to slow down, the defense could hear you, so you wanted to play faster to kind of like psych them out. Smart be making up stories <laughs> in his own head. Don't listen to Smart, man. I well, don't know what Smart is. I think the point of the fable was, the, the world of the story was that you've, you're playing with grace and kind of patience now and using your speed when it's, when it's really vital. So I guess, how do you feel like you've evolved as someone that knows when to use their powers at the right time? Yeah, just getting better. You know, I, obviously, I feel like I came into this league very talented, you know, but I've gotten better as I've gotten older. You know, I've been into, in the playoffs, I've experienced, and experience has been the best teacher. So I've improved and gotten better throughout this league. But, you know, I think I've always been, you know, talented. But like you said, as a 19-year-old, now I'm a 26-year-old. Yeah, of course I've gotten better. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.